Happy new release to everybody. This is one of them. Rittenhouse Game of Thrones inf uh, Inflections. Not Inflection? Inflections? Uh, this is not Break uh, 2. This is Break 1, by the way. Sorry. Look at the title right there. But big thanks to all of these folks right here for getting into it. Now, first of all, we got to open up the box. The case that's behind me right over there. We'll number all the boxes. Uh, we'll select a box. Open up the box. Open up all the stuff. We'll type in all of the hits, then we'll randomize however many times the dice tells it to. Randomize your names, randomize the hits, and put it all together, and that's what you get. According to CardboardConnection.com, the link is in the chat for this checklist. A lot of nice stuff in here, a lot of the actor autographs and stuff. Here's what we can expect from, uh, from each pack and from each box. So we could end up with base cards, or we can end up with some of the autographs too, but that's the thrill of the chase. So, good luck everybody. So here's the case right there. There it is. There's Game of Thrones on it. I know. I guess everyone's seen the finale by now. My Game of Thrones friends say that they're not. They were not too thrilled with the season overall. And that the the finale was a little too. Uh, I guess rushed. Here's all the boxes here. Let's flip this over. All right, so there's four stacks of five. So give me a minute here. Let me. Curtis says it was fire. People just like complaining. This is also. Keep in mind, Curtis also liked The Last Jedi. So take his commentary with a grain of salt. All right, so there's... That's one, two, three, four, five. I guess I'll keep this right over here. Six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. Right over there. Fourteen, fifteen. Although, well, I thought the, I thought Force Awakens was pretty good, Jason Bell. I go back and forth on there are a lot of things I like about Last Jedi actually cinematically. Sixteen. But I thought the story was weak. All right. Yeah, I don't think the producers were were intentionally putting water bottles on there just to just to troll everybody. <laughs> They invest, yeah, I'm sure HBO was thrilled about that if that was true. Where did my list go? Oh, there it is, right here. So what we're going to do is we're going to go actually generate a number between 1 and 20. Random number generator. And we'll do box. Oh, sorry. There it is, box 12. The mistakes get attention, Rex is saying. Attention for what? The series is over. It's, it's not a comedy. Well, I disagree with that, Curtis. There were a lot of things wrong with The Last Jedi. Flying, flying Princess Leia notwithstanding. But people have already watched Rex. It's, it was the last show of the series. <laughs> I don't know if I want people to rewatch just to look for, look for blunders throughout eight seasons of Game of Thrones. There's 12 right there. 
Now let's pop this guy open. And let's see what we have. Good luck, everybody. This is box 1051 of 8,000, in case you were wondering. All right. Has anyone actually seen these these hits? Do they look cool? The pictures look cool. I think the design of it look cool. We, we busted open a lot of Game of Thrones last year. What was that edition last year, you guys? Do you guys remember? What was that? Oh yeah, Valerian Steel is what we did last year. What what's a, what's an inflection? What is this? So what anyone know what this has to do with the show? All right, so let's see what we got. So we've got these guys. Oh man, I should not actually read the backs of these. I'm eventually going to watch the show. <laughs> All right, there's your autograph. Steven Delane. He's that guy, that character. Has it been a year since we've done non-sports, Curtis? No, we did, we did uh, Infinity War last month. Actually, we did Infinity War with the Hit Parade graded comics. I think you missed that. All right, and that's out of 75. Something's happening here. Oh, his duplicity revealed. All right, so I don't know how I'm going to do this. Um, we'll just order these this way. I guess. So that's how I'll. So from the first card to the back card is how I'll type them in. Type them in. And a gold ink autograph of Owen Teal. That's a cool autograph. Actors, these actors have nice, nice autographs compared to some of the rookies that we see in some sets. There's the, uh, well, that's terrifying. What, what is this guy? Some sort of, some sort of walker, some sort of, looks terrifying. All right, a lot going on there. And there's that laser cut right here too. Or no, this is this is a relic. There you go. That's that girl from Terminator Salvation. Or Genesis. So that's a piece of the chain mail that she's wearing or something like that. So, so there you go. I wouldn't hold my breath with that, Waynes. I don't think that's a little off-brand for us. Set that right there, and we've got we've got this kid right here. All right, there you go. So those are your. We have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, perfect. All right, now let's see who gets what. So give me a minute here. And I'm going to actually stack all of these cards up like so. And then we're just gonna, I'm gonna type all these up. So bear with me here, ladies and gentlemen. If you're watching the replay of this, you can definitely um, fast forward through this part. You should. I'm just going to go by card number right here, too. That's 41. That's 117. Oh, and the autographs. The 
type it out there. So Colton saying no major auto from the first box. Yeah, you guys are going to have to let me know. Boys and girls have to let me know what uh, what the good ones are or wh what isn't so we can I can announce that too. That was the serial numbered card. This is card 16, 9, and 114. There's the Owen Teal Gold Auto. There's Lenticular 2. LT 5370. 53 and 70. Card 106. VR11. That was the relic. The laser cut is L19. And the last base card was number 42, Jackie Robinson. All right, so that should be. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Perfect. All right, now let's roll the dice. Let's randomize each list eight times two and a six. Your names first. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven and eight. Six and two. Eight times. After eight times, we got Daniel down to Colton. And eight times for the card numbers. <coughs> Excuse me. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eighth and final time. Good luck. After eight times. We've got the relic on top, VR11, down to the base card 42. So here's how it shakes out. Daniel, you have VR11. I'll show all the cards in, again in a second. Andy, with the these are the numbered ones, just base cards, I'm afraid. Michael, you've got one of the autographs. Colton, with the uh, is that that's the lenticular, the 3D card. Anthony, you have the numbered card. Gabe Gilo with the Owen Teal Gold Auto. And there's Daniel Patera. You've got these three right there, including the laser cut. And then Colton, you have card 42. So there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That was a nice one-box break. So here, let's show you the, the these cards again. There was the Relic. Slide these cards up here. There was L2, which is which is really cool. I love those things. There's the gold auto. The numbered card. Sorry. Sorry, Steven Delane. There's the other two cards right there. And there it is. That's a nice one box break of Game of Thrones inflections. We just got it in today, so check out more of that on jazbeescasebreaks.com, and we'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.